Did you know that the Walton family, owners of Walmart, have a combined wealth of over $200 billion? That's more than the gross domestic product of some countries. Welcome to the unseen world of family empires, where fortunes are built over generations and names become synonymous with success. Picture this, a single family, the Waltons, hold wealth that could rival the economic output of entire nations. It's an astonishing reality, isn't it? These aren't just rich families, they're dynasties, powerhouses of industry and commerce. Their influence is woven into the fabric of our society, and their stories are a testament to the power of ambition, resilience, and legacy. But let's not get too carried away with the Waltons. They're just one example of the many family empires that have shaped our world. So buckle up, because we're about to take a deep dive into the remarkable world of family empires. But the Waltons are just the tip of the iceberg. Let's dive deeper into the world of family empires. Picture this, the year is 1760, and Meyer Amschel Rothschild is laying the foundations of a banking dynasty that will span continents and centuries. Born in a Frankfurt ghetto, Meyer was determined to break free from the chains of poverty. He started small, dealing in rare coins and antiques, but his keen eye for opportunity soon led him to the world of finance. Meyer's five sons carried his legacy forward, each establishing a branch of the Rothschild banking business in the major financial centers of Europe, Frankfurt, Vienna, London, Naples, and Paris. Their network was unprecedented, their influence unmatched. They financed kings and governments, funded wars, and shaped the economic landscape of the 19th century. Their cunning business strategies, combined with a tight-knit family bond, allowed them to amass unfathomable wealth. They became patrons of the arts, philanthropists, and key players in international politics. The Rothschilds were not just bankers, but architects of an empire, building a legacy that transcended time and borders. Despite facing anti-Semitism, wars, and financial crises, the Rothschilds stood tall, proving that their empire was not built on sand, but on a solid foundation of resilience and strategic thinking. The Rothschilds didn't merely survive, they thrived, setting an example for generations of entrepreneurs to come. The Rothschilds proved that with strategic thinking and resilience, one can build an empire that lasts. From banking, let's turn our attention to another lucrative industry, oil, and no one did it better than John D. Rockefeller. Now, if you ever wonder who the pioneers of the oil industry were, the name Rockefeller would undoubtedly come up. John D. Rockefeller, a name synonymous with immense wealth in the late 19th and early 20th centuries, founded Standard Oil in 1870. His shrewd business acumen and relentless ambition led to the creation of a monopoly that controlled nearly 90% of America's oil refineries and pipelines. But the legacy of the Rockefellers extends far beyond the realm of business. Aware of the immense responsibility that came with their wealth, they chose to give back to society in extraordinary ways. The family's philanthropic contributions have touched virtually every facet of American life, from education and health to the arts and environmental conservation. The University of Chicago, the Rockefeller University, and the Museum of Modern Art in New York are just a few examples of institutions that owe their existence to the generosity of the Rockefellers. Their philanthropy has left an indelible mark on American society, influencing the development of major institutions and shaping the landscape of the nation. So, as we marvel at the Rockefellers' business achievements, it's equally important to remember their tremendous contributions to society. They've shown us that true wealth isn't just about accumulation, but also about making meaningful contributions to the world around us. The Rockefellers showed us that wealth isn't just about accumulation, but also about giving back to society. Now let's take a flight to India, home to one of the richest and most influential families, the Ambanis. Our story begins with Dhirubhai Ambani, a man whose ambition took him from the humble beginnings of a petrol station attendant to the owner of India's largest conglomerate, Reliance Industries. Dhirubhai's phenomenal rise was not a stroke of luck, but a testament to his vision, determination, and business acumen. He believed in the power of dreams and the value of hard work, principles he instilled in his sons. Fast forward to the present day, the torch has been passed to the next generation, Mukesh and Anil Ambani. They have not only upheld their father's legacy, but also expanded it into new frontiers. In the realm of technology and telecommunications, Mukesh's company, Reliance Geo, has revolutionized India's digital landscape. With affordable data plans and extensive network coverage, Geo has made the internet accessible to millions, transforming the way India communicates, works, and learns. 
Anil, on the other hand, has ventured into diverse sectors, from entertainment to power generation, exhibiting the same entrepreneurial spirit that characterized his father. Their journey, like their father's, is a testament to the power of ambition. It's about seeing opportunities where others see obstacles, about dreaming big, and having the courage to turn those dreams into reality. The Ambani story is one of ambition, innovation, and the power of dreaming big. Now for the piece de resistance, the family that has perhaps built the most important empire of all. An empire so vast, so influential, it's impossible to imagine our world without it. They have left an indelible mark on an industry that touches everyone's lives. This family didn't just build a business, they shaped the future. They had the vision to see what could be and the courage to make it happen. Their journey wasn't always smooth. They faced obstacles that would have broken lesser spirits, but they persevered holding fast to their shared vision and each other. Their achievements are staggering. They've revolutionized their industry, pioneered new technologies, and forever changed the way we live. Their influence spans continents, and their legacy will echo through the ages. Yet their greatest achievement isn't measured in patents or profits. It's the bonds of family that held them together, the shared values that guided their journey, and the enduring spirit of innovation that propelled them forward. Through it all, they remained a family, bound by love and shared purpose. Their story is a testament to the power of family, the strength of unity, and the boundless potential of the human spirit. This family, dear viewers, is none other than the. Their story is a testament to the power of family, innovation, and resilience.